Hello everyone, welcome back to episode 23 of We Happy Few. Oh, I just realized Gwen's crib is cardboard box on a table, I guess. Hello there, and also I think I need to drink something. Maybe before we leave I should fill- oh no, 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 oh damn it. Uh, it was an accident. I took some sunshine. Okay, so I think I'm gonna filter some water before I go. What is this noise? Is this coming from my left downstairs? Yes, this must be my broken lab downstairs. So... Okay, we're all out of sunshine. That's definitely not good. For when we travel back. Because we don't have any. We don't have the right things to craft more. Right? Sunshine, it requires... An empty pill bottle, flower bag, and bleach. Hmm. Well, then maybe we should start looking around a little bit more. When we're out. So, well then, I will go back to Eel Pie and I will see you then because this will be another long way. Wait a second, so we can take on this quest of Sally as well? I mean, we didn't rescue Peachy as Arthur. I'm also not that interested in doing it now. Oh well, there's quite a lot going on here. So, I think we're almost there. People forget that. What's happening? Oh, it's a telephone call. This is for the benefit of Mr. Kite. The rabbit got into the garden. The rabbit got into the garden. Sounds like some sort of secret message. So you look just like your Aunt Lizzie. Funny. Aunts are supposed to be grown-ups, aren't they? She was six years old when Grandmum did it. She'll never turn seven. What happened in Sally's family? Also, I always thought that those secret codes to Mr. Kite were from Prudence, but... We found out what happened to Prudence, so I guess she can't be the one calling Mr. Kite. So, this is Sally's house. So, I guess somewhere here around should be Arthur's house too. Oh, yes, memories. Well, young Miss Boyle. You know there's a curfew. You don't want some Fritz to shoot you dead, do you? Sorry, sir. Let's get you home. You had another fight with your mum, didn't you? Why don't I put in a good word? Miss, uh, Mrs. Boyle? I've got a young lady out here who, um... I'm sorry. They don't seem to be at home. What? Let me go in. They're not at home. Let me take you to the station for a cup of tea. What happened? Let me in. Best you don't go in, miss. A cup of tea's best. What did she do? What did she do? What, what did she do? Oh. I've got a young lady out here who, um... So it said once that Sally's mom poisoned the whole family, so maybe this is the moment and Sally wasn't home because she ran away. Oh no. Unless you don't go in, miss. Okay. So this is the same police officer from from Arthur's past. Who didn't let Arthur go on the train. 
Oh no. To all citizens with children. Notice to all citizens with children. By the authority of the occupation authority, all children who will be under the age of 13 on 22nd of July should now have been registered with the town clerk. Please present your children at the Wellington Wells train station on the morning of tw July 22nd at 9 a.m. for transport to Germany. Enclosed is a list of clothing and supplies they will need for their voyage. Note that if your child has issues with bedwetting, rubber pants and serviettes must be provided. Prior to the voyage, school-aged children should attend an all-day orientation on 9th of July at the Wellington Wells Comprehensive School. Bring a lunch. Miss Victoria Bing will conduct an orientation for younger children on 20th of July with songs and games to prepare them for the trip to Germany. It is imperative that parents portray this travel as an exciting opportunity for a youngster so as to avoid anxiety at the train station. Please rest assured that the children's absence will only be temporary. So did Sally's mom kill the children and herself to save them from going to Germany? And mom said, you don't have to worry about the train. No one's going on the train. Shut up, Sally. You're a big girl. Stop crying. Oh, wow. Sally's mom killed her killed the family just because she didn't want them to go to Germany. I'm just wondering, how old is Sally? Was Sally old enough to Was Sally old enough to not go on a train or did she just because she fought with her mom before? Um Did she just happen to not be there? So, what's. We can't pass here. Is there anything in here? Charcoal. Maybe that's useful too. Oh no. Is he dead or sleeping? Oh, he's dead. <laughs> so, Lennon is maybe also. Why am I trespassing? This is my own house. Empty pill bottle, that was good. We needed that. Oh no, there's more of them. Damn it, and we don't have anything to knock them out. Don't have those knockout syringes. Who's doing this knocking all the time? I'm just gonna sneak behind him. I suppose it's up there. Okay. It's very hard not to knock them out. But we can't. Oh no. Oh, he's the one knocking. Oh no. What what can what shall we do now? We have to get in there. We can't even knock him out. Oh great. I just realized I hit a plague guy. Oh, he died. That's good. Great. Can I search him? Hope I'm not getting a plague now. Really? How? Do <laughs> oh my god. Seriously, do I have to leave now? Can I climb out the window? No, it's jammed as well. Oh my god! <sighs> to be honest, this isn't... 
doing anything good for me liking Sally more because this is so much more complicated as she's saying so herself that she is. Oh, there's a flower to hide in. TV. So what am I going to do now? Am I just gonna go out and look for some lockpicks? Oh boy. Oof, this is definitely not helping in liking Sally. I don't know. She's a brilliant chemist. Shouldn't she like have a little bit of a start on having it's all falling apart. The center cannot hold. Shouldn't she have a little bit of heads of a head start and having chemicals and all that around? I mean, come on. Oh great. We're all just pawns on a chessboard. Oh great. Hey you, can you move along maybe? Oh, right, there's the second one. Oof. I don't even remember how to get lockpicks. Were they just lying around? They. Oof. Can't dig in the trash here, can we? Oh, yes, we can. Can we maybe throw a distraction now? So we can loot other houses. Church services. What's this? It's probably something that we already read as Arthur. I think we already noticed it. I think we already noticed. Okay, no. I, I think that we already noticed. We already have seen this. So... Although what's funny is that right we don't have this whole guilt thing going on right now. Mm, a rotten carrot, no thanks. Who was Uncle Jack before he was Uncle Jack? I, I can't remember. Supreme Executive Power must. Now is the time to dare and endure, right? <laughs> Watch out for the ones with plague. They look sick, but then they suddenly become wild dogs. No, oh, I'm not even trespassing. Is it because I said hello? At least we're both in this together. Never thought it would come to this, did we? Sally is also not really great at making conversation. Oh, what's this? Scrap from the O. Corrins, October 30, 1949. Sir Robert Bing states that he has sent a sternly worded letter to the provisional government of the Spanish Democratic Republic. It is impossible for dozens of children to simply disappear, and it is unthinkable that the Soviet authorities would use our children as a bargaining chip with the Americans, even communists or parents. So, did the, ch so the children, after being sent to Germany, they disappeared? Well, now we have a little bit more, but this doesn't help us get into... <sighs> oh well. Nope. So I got to get going a bit, but to be honest, at the moment, it's a little bit tough because it's just annoying. I even had to ask. It's dark as the hell is for that. What's this? A torch. Oof. Ooh, 
We have TNT now. <sighs> oh, there's memory up here. I can't expect me to wear that. Since when do you care about fashion? I thought that was only for silly girls. For God's sake, Gingham. I look like Hansel and Gretel. You've been looking a bit too... provocative. Provocative? I don't even wear a bra yet. Mm, maybe you should. You don't want men to get the wrong idea about you. First I'm not doing enough to get a man, now I'm trying too hard. Just wear the dress, will you? It'll keep away the wrong sort of attention. Hmm. So this is the same dress that Arthur remembers from when Sally left. Hmm. I don't really know what gingham is. I don't know if this is if this is a sort of fabric. The two musketeers in space. So this is the playground from Arthur and Sally's youth. The celebrated Mr. K. I guess this got here after that. Hmm. Why'd you take the vanilla? You know it doesn't work for you. How could you forget that? Oh well. I guess I would be happier about finding my memories if this wasn't just a drag right now. But the books don't tell you about their teeth. Oh, so frightfully sharp. Am I my brother's keeper? I don't know. Maybe I should wait for night time when everyone sleeps. Then I could sneak around. Ooh, and there's feathers. I don't know what they will do for us, but let's just collect it for now. Hmm. So yeah, at the moment I'm clueless. Oh wait, is this the station? Can we visit Ollie after all? That would be too nice. Just need something positive right now. Is this even? Is this even Ollie's station? Yeah. Or not? Yes, it is. Sometimes I envy them all, not remembering anything. Oh, great. Oof. So, where was the entrance? The other entrance? With the bell. It was somewhere here. Yeah, it must have been on this side. Hmm. So I don't know. I suppose it won't work, but maybe it will. Who knows? Okay, so it must be this side. Yes. Or not? Where's the stupid door? I could have. 
It was somewhere here, right? Yeah, it was here. Really, they removed the bell? Okay, but this looks definitely like a path, so I suppose something will happen here later. Honestly, at the moment, I would really just like to stop, because this is annoying me. On the other hand, I'm scared that if I stop now, I will never want to play this game again. Because when you stop at a uh, lame moment, it's harder to restart the game. It's harder to get back into it and try again. Wait, is this, is this a station? Is this a hatch? Can we fast travel them? Oh, great. <sighs> is this? Gwen? Don't be afraid of the dark. Just bring a torch. The moment I'm a bit confused of where we even. Oh, wait! Oh, we are not. I get it now. Do I? I'm not so sure. At first, I thought that we were in the middle. Like we started but now we're in the hatch near dr faraday's house so because i reckon because it was those plague monsters and there's a lot of plague things here so i'm so confused hmm These are all letters that we already read as Arthur. Oh, oops. Didn't want to do that. So... Hmm. Okay. What I'm thinking now is... Maybe if we enter the puppet theater, maybe there's something more to loot. I go in there? Oh yes, I think that's the house that didn't hate us. So... Now, let's go to the puppet theater and find out what they Where have to are say. The Where are the Russians? You know the brother's keeper? This house looks interesting though, and if it's locked, it usually means something. Yes, no, that's just loose screws. I still don't understand why I need a tool to get off, to take off some cans off a hook. I guess everyone's up there, so I won't go. Oh, it's a workbench. I wish I weren't such rubbish at tinkering. Yeah, I thought so. I thought so that we couldn't use this because it said so in. And our personality list. Oh, okay, so this is a theater. So the front was locked. Yes, this is our way in. Oh, great. I just have to use my hand. Don't be ridiculous. We're a puppet theater. How about if I use my sock? We can't 
don't do Ibsen with sock puppets. We need... What happened to your dolly? Oh, that loony who lives in the treehouse. He managed to convince some idiot to steal it. We can't put on our show without a puppet. And it's a shame. We're really the only fun people can have around here. Unless you count taunting the bobbies. Maybe I can talk to him. And convince him to give your doll back. I doubt it. He thinks the doll is Peachy Carnan, one of his secret agents. Hmm. I can be fairly convincing sometimes. <laughs> hmm. Okay, so this is actually a bit sad because... <laughs> that's a picture of Arthur. Adversity builds character, right? We must have lovely characters about now. We've got to stick together here. Spirit, anyway. <laughs> so actually, that's a bit sad that this mission exists because Arthur didn't steal the puppets. <laughs> uh, oh well. <sighs> Arthur didn't steal. The, we didn't steal the puppet back then, but now it's gone, and Arthur stole it. So I guess in a way. We did steal Beef Wellington. Peachy. Wellington Pie. Where are the Americans? Where are the Russians? Oh, Mrs. Marley. What's that? I warned her against taking vanilla and chocolate together. You can lose your balance. Nothing much to fuss about, I guess. What's happening here? Dearest Archie, I doubt you'll ever read this, darling, but if you do, please forgive me. I know you wanted me to wait for the fourth flavor, but I couldn't. The vomiting was bad enough, but the memories came back. They began screaming every day, all day, and the steam whistle and those horrible huge steel wheels every day. I still hear them out there, but it's quiet. If you talk to them a bit, they quiet down, even though you know you're lying to them and they know it. It's a ghost town here. The streets are crowded with ghosts. Most of them are friends. But there is very little to eat. I'd hope to make my money last a bit longer, but I put it in a safe for keeping and I've lost my key. You'd mock me for a silly woman, but I haven't eaten in days. I think if I can get the safe up to the roof, I can drop it onto the pavement and if all goes well, it will break open. I wish you were here to help. You're so good mechanically. Not a very oh. well made safe, is it? Oh no, so she tried to open her safe by climbing up the roof and then I guess she fell down herself. The woman gave me and I did eat. That's too bad. That's the one who did it! Oopsie. Nope. Okay. I I should have known that. Oof. Well then. Off we go. That's the one who did it! She's the murderer! Oh great, and I also did it. I couldn't have picked a better spot. Okay, so they don't come around the corner now. Okay. Mm. Oh, great. No, she saw me. Um. Mm. Oops. Okay. I should be good now. But how is... What was this the mission? Search Mrs. Marley's body. Oh. Hmm. I had to do that. Oh well. Let's eat something in the meantime. Okay. Everyone's gone. <sighs> I feel like there's a pattern here because every cuz I was um thinking that some of the garden districts episodes from Arthur were boring too, and I, I and I'm afraid that this one will be as well. Mask Especially because I don't know. For ten minutes, I'm just wandering around and being pissed at the game. Oh well. 
sorry about that. I guess there is a simple solution to all of this that I just don't get at the moment. Also, there's a very long walks we're taking here. You won't get away with this, Dr. Verloc. I've come to stop your evil scheme. Ha ha! You've fallen into my evil trap! What's going on? Hmm. I can't move! Yes, miss, can't you read? No girls allowed. Even if one of those girls is a secret agent? You're an agent of the Special Operations Executive? Prove it. I've been inside Dr. Veloc's lair. Shh! Don't say that out loud. I've met Sergeant Stubbs. And I know what his favorite code is. Do you? All right, all right. You are a secret agent. Central needs Peachy to go on a secret mission. It's a very important very dangerous mission behind enemy lines. Peachy? You can't expect me to let you take Peachy? I think we have to ask Peachy whether he wants to go or not. Don't we? He doesn't want to go, do you, Peachy? Oh. Oh. Well, that's very brave of you. No, of course, Peachy. We all know there's a war on. Well, if we don't meet again, it's been an honor to command you. Safe travels, Peachy. He says he'll go with you. God be with you both. So, Alfie, what does he sell? You made it back. Good man. Good man. <sighs> nothing that we can buy and nothing that's of any use to us. Hmm. Not quite what I'm looking for. You're seeing it, Sally. Why did my mum pick that fight with me? To save me or to punish me? Hmm. Did Sally's mom send her away on purpose? Honestly, this feels just a little bit hopeless here. After Perhaps playing Arthur. It has the general shape of a god node. That is, it is short and Who could just take out people from the back? And now being Sally, a chemist who doesn't even have knockout syringes in, in stock. <sighs> or any of the components. Or, am I, or was I just as stupid to search her lab? Was there a lot of that stuff in her lab back then? I don't know. But her lab blew up. The worst thing about Joy is... You can't read people. How are you supposed to know who people want you to be if you have to rely on what they say? Maybe that's Sally's problem. She's always trying to be what people want her to be. <laughs> How did you get our dolly? I did. And I don't think you'll have any more trouble with Johnny Bolton. Oh, that's wonderful. Do you want to stay for our show? We'll be able to start it in a few moments, thanks to you. When did my squirrel come home? Just now. Don't disturb me. Bought, did you say? All these things. My little spendthrift been wasting money again. <laughs> yes, but okay. it's so, what are we supposed to? Do I guess we're to climb this? Oh, please let there be some lock picks here. strange house.
Please, can there be some lockpicks? Nope. What the hell? Boxing shoes? Oh no. What? Can I jump out of the window or something? Oh no. They're coming. Or can I wait for them to just stop? Of course I won't. Oh, God. Oh, I don't have a lockpick to open this. Of course. <sighs> Gotta say, this is really frustrating. Not in a good way frustrating. We do find a lot of books as Sally, but this doesn't really make me happy. Oof. So I gotta pass this guy now. Okay, well let's just go. Ouch! You did it, didn't you? Gonna... No! Ah, I'm stuck. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Alone. How do you Anyone? even? Get him! <sighs> what? Which one am I? I did nothing wrong. Okay, well, I stole something, but yeah. Everyone is still treating me like a killer. So, what do these bowling shoes do anyway? Run like the wind and don't break your ankle with these snazzy shoes. Hmm, I'll take those. What are you so suspicious about? I'm... I didn't even do anything! Okay. <sighs> why can't I... Why can't anyone send some... Lockpicks? Oh well. I'm really frustrated. My side effects. Oh. <laughs> if anyone knows how to get lockpicks fast in here, like we're all just on a chest. please tell me, because I really, I don't know, I can't right now. I'm really annoyed right now. I wanted to give Sally a chance, but she's just annoying me. Although this is although this is not her fault, this is the game's fault, but this is like really no. I don't know. I think it's a very it's 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 a very complicated thing because you you buffed Arthur up. So we were doing really good back then and now they just set you back to zero and not even to zero. They just they set you back to zero, and they even take stuff from you. They even take the mechanics from you. We can't knock people out just like we used to, but we have to have um, we have to have some tools to do it with. In this case, the syringes, which we don't have the crafting components for. And I don't know. There is just. 
just anything taken from us. We can't just take out people um, in their houses to, to loot it. But also we can't continue with the main story because we don't have the needed tools. Like lockpicks. I could have been more charming to Robert Catesby. He could have helped. He's no fan of rules. But he's such a pig. Oh. <sighs> So, yeah, to be honest, I think I'm going to give up for today. This is going to be a boring episode again, but maybe that's just a garden district. So, you know what? I'm just going to risk it. We've been here before, haven't we? Don't belong here. Get I know I don't belong here. Oh well, more empty syringes that we can't fill. Ouch. Oh well. There was a bobby pin. There was a bobby pin. Oh no. There was a bobby pin on the table. I saw it. I saw it. Oh, I'm bleeding. Great. Oh no, it wasn't here. It was here. What the hell? I'm stuck. No! Okay, I'm dying. Not anymore. Okay. Good night. Oh please, don't let this all be loose screws. No, down there there are lockpicks. Suppers! Over! Oh you please. Stop here. Okay, I think we're doing it. Oh, I'm gonna make a run for it. Oh, let's go. Oof. Okay. So maybe that's the only choice we have right now. Breaking and entering and just ignoring everyone. So. We have enough to make one lockpick, right? Yes. Oh, we have some Jimmy Bar too. Okay. So, but this is still something that we're going to do in the next episode. Although I don't know where we're going to start next if I stop now. Ugh. You know what? Let's, uh, let's just do it. Let's just go in. Let's just pick this stupid lock and get this over with. Still oh, bleeding. That's it for this dress. <laughs> what? Oh my god. <laughs> Why is everything... Oh, I didn't... How did he see me? Oof, just go ahead. Why don't you die? Oh. I'm still bleeding and I don't have a bandage. Though I can craft a bandage, right? I can craft a bandage later. Wait, there's a back door. So, yeah. I'm gonna craft a bandage now. Okay. So, what about this here? Oh, it's jammed. How convenient. So... Is everyone chilled out now a little bit? Are you freaks?
I bet you can tell that I'm mildly annoyed by this episode so far. So, okay. I don't care if he sees me right now, I'm just gonna walk up. Okay, he's still out, so... Let's hope that there's nothing more locked in there. Let's hope that there's some more materials in Sally's room. So, what's going on here? I'm gonna take this. Oh, another bobby pin, very good. It's the beginning. Is there someone in the room too? Beaker, a thermostat, N7 triad. I think I can fix my lab. <sighs> of course, it's time to feed one. the windows are barred. Kind of makes sense that we can't climb out of it. So where is this? Where is that guy? Oh, I don't care if they see me right now. Oh great. Get off me. What killer? People in the garden district are starting to annoy me. Okay. Why are they referring to me as a he? I'm a woman. <sighs> okay. So, I'm going to end this. We got what we wanted. Maybe I will um, walk the path back home off episode. So, I won't have to cut it out later. So far, I'm not a big fan of the Sally act. Maybe it will get better. Maybe it won't. Anyway... Thank you for watching, thank you for enduring this episode with me, and hopefully I will see you next episode when a little bit more is happening. That was a weird ending, anyway, thanks for watching and I will see you next time. <laughs>